The Zambia China Zhangxi Multi Facility Economic Zone has finally positioned itself as a vibrant of manufacturers. With an initial investment of 30 million United States dollars, the car lithium battery manufacturing will start operating by the end of October this year, where over 3,000 jobs are likely to be created. The, um, the company is about to to commence the the fully production of the batteries and these other ones that I mentioned earlier, and then. Uh, after the normal production, we are yet to create uh, more than uh, or at least uh, 3,000 jobs for the locals. The zone also hosts a copper wire and cable manufacturing plant, which has an initial investment of 10 million United States dollars. We need to put a 10 million US dollars investment uh, here and uh, to produce, produce cables and the wires. Also, we want to uh, cherish the opportunity of China and Zambia. Zamtrans Electro Limited has invested 7 million United States dollars in producing and repairing electricity transformers. Electro Limited, we are basically manufacturing uh, transformers, power transformers, and distribution transformers. We manufacture, supply, and repair as well. Media and Information Director Spokesperson Henry Capata to work the facility and he's impressed with the levels of investment. So you can see how hyperactive the district has become. You can see this project, the light it has brought. The battery, uh, the lithium battery is talking about 3,000 jobs. We are crossing over to the transformer, they are talking about a good 100. When they are done, they should be crossing somewhere around 300, 300, 400. We have seen the tractor, provision for the tractor, the fertilizer, soya beans, everything is here. So what next is to drive the agenda? And this is the agenda of government. We have a pilot, the President of the Republic of Zambia, that has been talking about it. So when this was commissioned, a lot of people have been passing through the road, but not necessarily coming inside to see what is happening. So in short, government is extremely humbled, excited that it is happening in Chibombo. Reporting for the News News in Chibombo, I'm Tishuke Kaunda.